I mean, yeah, I'd probably be convinced. Satan like, would have dude. A, Satan could convince me to do so much stuff. It wouldn't even be that hard. If a snock, if a snocking, if a talking snake told me to do anything, I'd do it. I do, I do most things for a talking snake. We're back, Jesse. After much time away. You smell it? No. I smell a. You know a I don't have my sense of smell. I lost I it. I smell a. Oh I shit! Are you hopeless coward? How did you remember that? How did you remember that, Jesse? It's been like a month. Uh, we gotta find this coward so we could afford more noodles. <laughs> the game wants me to heal, but I'm no coward. Yeah, stop. Get off our fucking back, game. So, um, as, far, as far as I can remember, we're like working for the smoke and toad. We did some. We need to. Side we're like. Jobs. We're unlocking the world. Oops, I messed up. Dude, look at that one guy. He's having a rough fucking day. Wait, wait, can we, can we watch this No, we guy? can't go back to that guy. Why is there a dot over here? Jeffrey, point out the, the guy that's... There's a digression. What does that mean? I don't fucking know. Oh, it's for Sanson. Oh, it's... Yeah. Does it? Do we get, like, special side, side missions for the servants? That'd be cool. I think eventually we will, but I just want to keep... I want to keep playing the game to... To like unlock more of the map so we can choose what we want. Yeah, we gotta collect them all. I'm not like, convinced. If... Hold oh, on, we need to talk about this right now. Uh huh. Right now. As we've we've disagreed on this slightly in the past, and I kind of put it aside, but I can't get it out of my head. Mm -hmm. I'm not convinced this saber is a woman. <laughs> I are I do, you, seriously. I think it that. might be. A, I think it's a guy. You think this is a dude? I'm not getting any. It's just any, so like, unfate like. It's very unfate. I don't. For whenever I look at this character, mm -hmm. this goes to a conversation from before we were recording. I don't get anything from this. This does nothing for me. There's only one way to check. Can we look up the greaves? Maybe. No way. I feel like I'm looking at a little boy. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I agree. I just don't like him, Herbert, at all. So, it, like, even I if think, it wasn't a I sexual thing, I think they're thing, fine, like... but I'm not in a sexual way. I don't think it's a woman. I think it's just an androgynous <laughs> child. <laughs> what is she doing? She's like, pick me, pick me. It's just something. Yeah, to think. I just needed my like my feelings known on the issue. Okay. You have been noted it's an androgynous child. Well, no, I don't know that. That's just how I feel. Need I, say? I see. What do you so got in fit... stock? Well, oh, thank you. Some... We bought all her honey rice cakes. Yeah. We can... Oh, we were, like, running out of money, though. I'm bad at this game. poor, man. We're on that grind. Well, there's one of these things. Dried lizard? Uh... Cloth scraps. <laughs> Dang. Dude, I love me some cloth scraps. Oh, look at all this. I know that, like, being a woman in any time period is hard, but anytime you hear about, like, a medieval woman having her period and they're like, oh, like, you're on the rag. Dude, that's fucking rough. I can't even imagine. It's like putting some cloth scraps in my. In, but my then the worst is up. how bad that is. The fact that then everyone is like, but you're also like a dirty witch and this is your fault. <laughs> it's your fault that this happens to you because of your terrible sin. Because you... Yeah, we need to find this hidden school. Because Eve is a fucking deviant, man. She ate that apple. Is that really such a bad thing, though? What was, what, the, apple about, what was man? the apple doing oh. there in the first place? <laughs> man. That seems like entrapment I, to me. It is. It's 100% entrapment. Even if we're just going by like normal, like biblical standards. Like Satan was literally entrapping people. No, like, no, no. Damn, I'm, no, I'm saying God entrapped them. 
Well, Satan was the one that imagine somebody comes up to you and says like, "Hey, I have this really cool apple. Like you've never had an apple like this. It, like not even magical powers. Like this is like a really cool <laughs> apple, Dan. Would you take a bite of it?" <laughs> I mean, yeah, I'd probably be convinced. Satan like, would have dude, a, Satan could convince me to do so much stuff. It wouldn't even be that hard. If a snot, if a snocking, if a talking snake told me to do anything, I'd do it. I do. I do most things for a talking snake. But my thing is, you. So let's say I made to keep this modern thing going, Jesse. I made like a cool house for you to live in, and mm. I, it was like perfect. Everything there was excellent all the time. But then I put this won't work for you because you're an unhealthy human. But there's one apple in the house. That Dude, I'm I like, like apples. We've already yes, established. You I'm claim an apple that, eater. but I've never seen it with my own eyes. But okay. I say, everything in this house is great and perfect. Oh, by the way, I'm going to leave this apple here. That's not for you to eat, though. All right, see you later. Hey, Dan, you've lived with me. You know that I will eat your peanut butter. <laughs> you <laughs> like, will. I, but my point is, I like, yes, it. that's what God did. Why is the forbidden fruit there? It was entrapment. Then he can't get upset whenever they eat it. It's like, motherfucker, what'd you leave it here for then? You knew this was going to happen eventually. Oh, I see. So wait, I'm I'm misremembering the Bible. So like the Bible is literally like the beauty and the beast where the beast is like, don't go to the east wing. Like it, it existed in the garden. And I think, but like, I think like, then don't touch it. Satan then convinced her to eat what was there. Oh, I don't think Satan I brought see. it to her. I think it was in e or in Eden already. Yeah, God, you fucked up. You really That's fucked up. That's a dick move. That's a dick move, man. Don't worry, we've been, we've been talking about even apples for the past 10 minutes. We're not going anywhere. It's because we're, we're we're too busy thinking about it has been her hotel, Dan. It's just on our minds all day and That's night. That's because we were just talking about it, but... I, it's so good though. I'm gonna say I'm a fan. Dan isn't sold yet, but I'm not. Sold. I think he will be. He will be eventually. And I, I'd like to think that neither one of us are, are like too horny for it, as you've told me the rest oh. of the internet is. Before you wait, wait. He had a move called like the greased, the greased falcon or something. Can we get the greased falcon? What? That's not. These are like missions. Yeah. Oh, okay. There's one called like the greased something or other. I want. I want to do the greased one. Greased lightning. Greased lightning. <laughs> Is this a musical? Greased lightning. Uh. Yeah, we got tons of food. Don't worry about it. Did I ever tell you about the time that I actually saw, like, real entrapment in my life? Like, I was, like, working one time, like, doing a tour, and there were, there were actual, like, cops dressed like hookers, and they caught a dude, like, and they were, like, pulling him over right in front of my tour group. And we all watched this man get, like, arrested by these, like, hooker cops. It was crazy. It was wild. I don't like it.連中が突如今日を発したわけもない。おそらく何らかの種によって思考を犯されていたのだろう。うーん。ガラディヴォカスターオンアーハンズ。となると術師がいることになる。さてな。おお。I'm Oh, I can smell a wizard, though. I can smell a wizard from a mile away. I guess a master could also be cast in spells, too, but it seems more like a witch. I mean, I like that. It's straightforward. I don't think you will, though. Like, we've already encountered a million servants, and you've just been pretty chill about the whole thing. Uh-oh. Dude, I, I, know it's I the hate dark this hour. man. <laughs> you can't talk about the dark hour here. <laughs> it's the dark hour. 
Did you just call that book a man? Don't yeah, ever. Yeah, it's my. It's anything. our grandpa. No, he's not a man. <laughs> that book is. He ate weird. our grandpa. Oh fuck. Oh no, we can't not fight yet. Again. Well, it's not good fucking workshop, is it? He has a shit workshop, Grandpa. He fucked up. You need more concrete. Grandpa, teach us how to make concrete. Yeah, this area is too open. I'm gonna slice you in half. <laughs> yes. My servant? <laughs> okay. Okay, Kamina. <laughs> okay, where the hell the do you think this is? Oh. Dude, um, imagine you get the heroic spirit Kamina. How cool would that be? I would rather have Simon. Yeah, well... Like, Simon's the more powerful of the two. But Kamina, like, he's got that big dick energy. But I but I'm saying any energy that Kamina has, Simon has more of by the end. So I'd rather have him. Oh, I see. Like what you mean Simon when he's like sexy, when he has like a fucking cool jacket on. Yeah, with, what like, is he... going on? The <laughs> fuck? That's right. He just did a cool tag team and that skeleton warrior took no damage for some reason. Yeah, but he got knocked to the ground though, which is all that matters. Who's left? Let's fucking summon skull over here. Easy. Oh. oh. I hate when this happens. Oh, dude, this is perfect timing, too, because it's like Chinese New Year. You gotta fight like a Chinese Zodiac beast. What, is it the year of the uh, dragon? Right? The year of the dragon, yeah. I know, I, we all know how you feel about Chinese New Year, Dan, but like. Now it's, but now it's finally time, so it's okay. Oh, uh, okay, I see. How do I, how do I make Saber do stuff again? Is it this button? <laughs> this button. I think you have to hold them both together. Saber. No, that's how right? I become Saber. Oh, uh, okay. I just remember we had an extended argument about it at one point. <laughs> that's about most things we've discussed. Dude, I like this guy. He's kind of cute. I don't want to kill him. I would like it if he had like a real face, but he's got no eyes. So why does he That's look kinda, at That's kind of That makes him cute though. He's kind of like cousin it. I've never met cousin it. You wouldn't like him. Oh, push your earth stance. Quick damn block, a powerful attack. And get away from him. Going, he's going fucking nuts. <laughs> Such a powerful attack. Dude, what's like the blue meter on his body? Like his will That's to like live? to break him. <laughs> he's gonna, we're gonna break him soon. Do a big break. Why does Saber Giga want me to like, I don't have the, I don't, I have no power Saber. I can't help you. I don't know what you want from me right there. You need to go back to water, where the coming. power is. Do you think if John F. Kennedy was a servant, he would like have a the same like uh, like charming ability like Lancer from Fate Zero? Like uh, just women I, want probably to have sex with that him. would be his power. He wouldn't have protection from arrows. I'll tell you that right now. <laughs> I mean, which presidents would make the best servant? Uh, I mean, obviously, we're we're big proponents of Andrew Jackson. Like, he would be pretty cool. Andrew Jackson could be a berserker, man. But he's not. But he's not well known enough. I feel like. <laughs> well, then, obviously, Teddy Roosevelt. But do you think anyone would be better than George Washington? Oh, I see. As like, what class would he be, though? A writer. Yeah. 
Like he, 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 like you think he's like riding his like horse from like the French and Indian War, but then his like noble phantasms like his fucking boat from the Delaware River. <laughs> just like he pulls out a boat. I feel like his his noble phantasm would be like fucking revolution. Oh yeah. He would he would pull out his like hippopotamus dentures and like throw them and they would like become like a monster. I just think with the way fate works, I don't I have a hard time imagining any other president like surpassing that. I guess it's like how the Japanese see it. Yeah, like the Japanese like how they see like the American presidency. Truman. Yeah, that's probably their least favorite one, right? <laughs> I can't imagine he is too popular. <laughs> There's no way that Tight Moon would ever make a World War II or even World War I adjacent servant, though. Oh, I see. That would be too, like, much bad press for them, and I don't think they want that. They're not ready to put Hitler in there. <laughs> That would be pretty Would wild. Hitler be like a, a caster? Like, what Hitler's class be? <laughs> Hitler <laughs> would be... Probably... No, he'd probably be an Avenger. Oh, okay, I see. Because in his like twisted mind, Avenger. he's like getting the, the rest of the world back for World War One. It's like his, his twisted revenge. And he's like a crazy evil dude fits with most Avengers. Yeah, we've already established this. I mean, this, this is one of those times where it seems like we're not paying much attention to this, but also on the other hand, it's like, well, yeah, no fucking duh. I didn't think that these crazy monsters were just like happening. It, it was a coincidence. It was right outside my house. They'll come again in greater numbers. <laughs> All right, book, that's your job. How about this? You get on the workshop. We'll go do important things. I don't like, think we even need a workshop. We just kill everyone. <laughs> Gotta fix our work. We need, we need to irrigate the uh, the ley lines. We need to irrigate them so they go to our house. No, I don't want him to pound anything into me. <laughs> Dude, this book I'm not going to get pounded dude. by this book. What? I didn't get your joke, <laughs> to be fair. <clears throat> this book's gonna be the bad guy. He's gonna be the, like, villain of the story. <laughs> How is it that an expression that existed in Saber's time and exists in our time totally skipped over Iori? I think he's just an idiot. That expression yeah. definitely existed then as well. Iori just doesn't get out much. Dude, do, do, do we have to play like a mini game? Is it gonna be like in Red Dead Redemption 2 where they play a cool song? Like, <laughs> spend money and materials. We can't, we can't do it. We can't spend any money. We have none. <laughs> Listen, old man. I can patch the walls with my noodles if you want. But I can't can't be bothered to do any of this. Eat your heart out though? That hold, much on, money? hold on. What is eat your heart out though? This is important. Increase the amount of health oh. restored by food. Oh, that's important. We need, it takes food. It takes food to make, do food. We can't do any of this stuff right now, though. And we never have oh. to engage with that again if we don't want to. Open me up. Open me up, little boy, and read my mysteries. I don't want to open the man. Uh. Is that a sex thing? 
Connect to the ley line. Dude, what is this game? What the fuck? <laughs> We're gonna have to play like total war now and like move our little troops to like positions. I don't wanna go recruit new servants. Yes. They won't be part of the story, I'm almost certain, but they'll we'll at least be able to have them made, like, in-game to play as. Gotta access the spirit fronts and all the other districts. Fonts. How do we do that? Do we have to climb, like, the radio tower and, like, pull a lever? <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be something like that. Or kill a big monster or something. You need some more dense energy, bitch. So what does this actually affect in game terms? <laughs> Again, I think it's just opening up the, the map for us. So, like, I think if we have more spirit front power, do we become more powerful? I don't know. Time to train. Hell yeah. What do we do to it? It better not oh, be another mechanic. It is, Dan. Publishing. <sighs> I, why are there so many mechanics? Can we put like a little garden in our backyard and have grandpa like attend to it? <laughs> like, can we start like making this a, a farming game? Yes. I hate farming games. No. Oh my God. Yes. Do oh, it. I'm supposed to wait for the thing. I see. I've just been spamming the button. Oh, yeah. Success, I failed twice in a row. <laughs> okay, we got an XP boost now. That means nothing to me. I don't care about XP boosts. I can't, even get you to, I can't even get you to fix your fucking weapon in Liza P when it's broken and you're like in the middle of combat. Like, there's no way this game's gonna convince you to fucking maintain your sword. <laughs> like, when we're. Yeah, and I'm never gonna around. do that again. That's pretty easy though. Like, I'm glad she didn't develop a taste for like caviar. <laughs> yeah, right. And for just rice and miso soup, we were gonna have that anyway. Short ribs or something like that. Man, did I ever tell you about the fucking short ribs I bought this one time? You need like, to be more specific. <laughs> When you think of short ribs, though, like you think, okay, maybe we think differently, but like when I think of short ribs, I think of like the bigger thick bone, but in that huge piece of meat that you braise after like a long time and it becomes like really like fall apart, like beautiful. You know what I mean? I guess. I have no real thoughts on short ribs, though, like you seem to. But when I went to Costco, they had sh they had something that said short ribs. I was like, oh, cool. Like, I really want to make short ribs. I opened this bad boy up. And it's like, imagine, have you ever had those like really shitty ribs from like Applebee's? Like the ones that are just bones like broken apart. Oh, I know it was, like, a, it was, like, yeah. it was a bunch of small bones and like, like meat around the edges. And apparently this is very popular in Korea. Like you're supposed to like put them on the barbecue or something. Mm -hmm. And it was not at all what I thought it was for. And I was not happy about that. It was more like a bimbop kind of dig. Classic bimbap. Bimbap. Korean food is okay. I don't think it's as yeah. hype as everyone makes it out to be. They're all about that kimchi. Kimchi is good, but it's Koreans aren't the only people that use it. I I get quite enough kimchi in Japan. It's pretty common. 
Just some stinky cabbage, some spicy and cabbage. And I, I like it, but like actual like Korean food, people talk about how great like Korean barbecue is or Korean fried chicken. Dude. And I've had I, it and it's just kind of like, it's all right, yeah. but is it not any different than anywhere else is? It's all fucking Did you ever have a Korean pie. corn dog? I've never had a Korean corn dog, no. Dude, fuck that shit. Like, I was so excited to have a cream corn dog. They, they put sugar on the outside of it. So it's what? like, yeah, yeah, it's wild. Like, I was like really looking forward to it. It looked really good. Like, it looks like a corn dog, but like maybe just like fancier. And then they, instead of just like having like, I don't even know, just regular breading on the outside, they dust it with like sugar. Like there's, it's all covered in sugar. And I was like, what the fuck is this? Like, I don't want sugar on my hot dog. It was wild. Have we ever talked a common thing. about how popular corn dogs are in Japan? <laughs> no. <laughs> they're, they're called American dogs, and they're crazy popular. <laughs> like, everywhere. Dude, you can get them dogs. everywhere. I love American dogs. The people in Japan do, too, and I don't understand it. Are they like real though? Like, or are they like the ones that you can like microwave? Like, it depends on it depends on where you're at. I, they're they're of a decent quality most of the time. Food in Japan typically is, but at the end of the day, it's still a corn dog. Yeah, but like I could right now, like you were, like the, the fresh batter that they like actually like fry. It's like crunchy on the outside. Like I would fuck that up right now. No, the ones in Japan are the more soft kind, not the crunchy kind. Oh, they don't do like a hard fry on it. No, so it's, it is it's like soft it, batter. Yeah, that's like America, or that's like the freezer one. Though. But I, I feel like most corn dogs are like that. Even if you get them like fresh fried, they're usually not the crunchy kind. I am an elitist about my hot dogs, though. I think like, you have I, to be. The hot dog market's gone wild. <laughs> the hot dog market. Like, I mean, it has. Nathan's... If you're not picky with your hot dogs, you're gonna get some real shit. Oh yeah, like actual, like asshole, like pork asshole, pig asshole. Like Nathan's is pretty good. I I'm a big fan of Smith's, the natural cased wieners. From Smith. I mean, I can't give you any opinions because I'm I'm in a different landscape over here. Yeah, you got like your own sort of hot dog meta. There isn't really a hot dog meta because there aren't. You don't really ever see hot dogs. Really? Because when I think of like bentos, they always have like little octopus hot dogs and stuff. Oh, if if we can include those little like wieners, but that's not the same. Oh, so what you're saying is in Japan the wiener is smaller. Is that yes, what you're saying? they are. Those those wieners they don't have like a hot dog. Like a big hot dog, like you'd put in a bun to eat. An American, uh, like an American hot dog. And I'm sure if someone hears this and they want to say that I'm wrong, I'm sure you can get hot dogs somewhere, yes. But they're not, it's not normal, and I never see them. Dude, I'm just making a list of, like, business opportunities for Japan. Like, hot dogs, question mark? No, I'm telling you, good corn dogs, and you have a market, because they fucking love corn dogs. That could be part of it, for sure. And it's, if you go to a convenience store, there's always going to, like, the two things I guarantee you they will have, like, at the hot section, there will be fried chicken and there will be corn dogs. Uh, like, regular fried chicken or, like, karage, like, marinated, like, pieces? Uh, no, not karage. They will probably have that, too, but it won't be, like, the fresh stuff. That'll be in, like, the package section. Hmm. Hmm. Hmm? Like, this conversation has gotten too big for uh, for Yori right now, by the way. I don't know if you've been paying attention to it, but this guy's in over his head if this is what's happening. They don't, he, he was talking about the shogunate. Yeah, and they don't need to worry about any conspiracies if someone's influencing the shogunate or if, you know, they're involved. Like, dude, just go out and kill the people that are trying to kill you. Don't worry about it. I don't know how this guy gets through a day yeah. without like yeah. dying of a stress heart attack. But like, he's got so much shit to worry about. Did Shiro ever <laughs> worry about conspiracies? No, Shiro was just like, I've just got to go fight, kill, like protect. Simple. Protect. Don't Hero. think. This guy's got his fingers in all the pies, man. You can only have your finger in so many pies. 
特用地ならば数あるが上江戸にとっての基盤にあるうなうじゃや間を払うべく寛永寺が建てられている用地特に霊的なそれとしては、oh, dude, I just thought of something. Imagine, imagine you have a time traveling ability and you bring Uno back to the, the olden times. Dude, they would love that shit. They would love Uno. Probably. It's、so、such a, like, a simple game.、Games. They had card games. So it's, it would be popular, but you wouldn't like, take the world by storm. They'd be like, oh, cool, a card game. Like、a little fun game to play. They're, that's all they had to do for like fun is play fucking card games. So you introduce like the problem is depending on、game. if you go far too back though, what are you gonna like? Are you bringing the cards with you? Because that would impress them the most. The fact that you have so much paper that you've made these、oh, yeah. like laminate cards that would be the amazing、yeah. thing that's got colored ink on them. I'd be the card witch. <laughs> <laughs> it's me, the card witch. <laughs> Whenever you play Uno,、mm -hmm. are you someone that follows the rules? This is a leading question. Are you someone that follows the rules, Jesse? Or are you someone that、uh, plays. A rule breaker. <laughs> that is a rule breaker and will play like a plus two on a plus two? I think you should be able to stack the pluses, yes. If that's what you're asking. So I do not, not follow the rules. So you don't follow the rules, is what I'm hearing. Okay. I think you should be able to stack the pluses because it, 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 it results in a more violent game, a more directful, spiteful game. Like, I enjoy that when somebody gets spited. Like, that's always fun when somebody gets upset. It's not a real game unless somebody's upset. I, I play by the rules. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Because I like to win. And if you're gonna win, you need to like, be aware of the rules and what's happening. Yes, I'll fucking kill them. Yeah, why would you. What was the point of this conversation if the answer is no? <laughs> why are you expanding this conspiracy if you're then gonna tell your servant they can't like, do it? What did he say? Like, if somebody's in the government's bag, you can kill them or something? No, no, he's saying don't kill them. Oh. I don't like you. Like, Yori, you're kind of starting to piss me off. Oh, I see. <laughs> I mean, we're known all over town for killing, like, everyone else. I want to go there then. I love something strange. Yes. Oh, it's a weird. But I think if we go there and kill these monsters, we'll unlock its spiritual ley lines and we'll harvest the energy. I mean, back then was wild though. Imagine like the shit you would have to do back in the day to get like in trouble with the actual law. <laughs> like, you could be a woman. The first. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Spot on. But like the first person to ever think, like, oh, maybe we should like try to be like cool about like killing people or like sneaky about it. Like, that, they were a genius. It's getting wild. It's out of control here. What is I didn't this is not what I thought would happen here, Jesse. I'm not gonna lie to you. I did not think this was gonna become like this. Okay, so what happens when we move? Is this Final Fantasy? Ah, oh, man. I'm gonna end the episode right here. No, we need to know what happens with the ley line. Well, we'll find out next episode. Oh, baby, I forgot about my bit here. So, you, you struggled last episode. It was two failures. If I recall, it was fucking garbage nonsense. You, one of them was a fucking.
One of them, one of them was a listen, satellite. <laughs> one of, no, but the first one was an easy one that you got wrong. And so then you specifically told me to give you a difficult one. Oh, uh, So I did. Yeah. I asked you. Now I'm going to ask you again, Jesse. Should uh -huh. we go a bit easier to build up your confidence? <laughs> Dan, you're you're asking me a leading question because of course I'm I I don't want to back down I don't no want to I show. think but I think we should I think we should okay. give you a bit of an easier one so you can kind of like right. feel good about yourself yeah yeah give me an easier one because I can't do satellites that's nonsense that's gobbledygook yeah but this I want you to get one right so you can kind of like be a man again okay. Oh, I need to minimize this. Ooh. Okay. Is this easy? I'm looking at a girl. She kind of mm -hmm. looks like she should be in Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> Definitely a Yu-Gi-Oh girl. Um, oh, okay. We got Egypt. We got kind of like wild hair. I'm trying to think. Any other clues? She is, uh, she's a white person in Egypt, so I'm gonna say that's Cleopatra. <laughs> yes, you are correct. That is okay. Cleopatra. <laughs> Bonus point, so Jesse, you didn't say what class Cleopatra is. Oh yeah, you're right. Uh, definitely a caster, right? Assassin. Assassin. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, I get that. Yeah, I mean, she killed herself, but yeah, they, they're they're she grasping into, like, straws, snakes. but yeah, they're kind of image like that. I gave you one where the background helps, because you were really big into the backgrounds last time. <laughs> but it was it was the fact that she was a white person in Egypt. <laughs> like I, yeah, that's kind of what I thought, too. Like, this had to be. <laughs> if you would have said anyone else, there'd be no redemption. All right. You feel good now, Jesse? You feel confident? I do. I got my 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 big dick energy flowing. My ley line energy is, is you harvested prime that right line. now. Thank you, Cleopatra. Oh, yeah. All right. Goodbye. <laughs>